Mama asked if I could do a favor or two for her. Yes, ma'am, I certainly can do that for you. She wanted me to take an old pullover sweatshirt and make it into a cardigan. Oh, no problem. Uh, can you do it without cutting the front? <laughs> of course I can. Let me show you how we did this. The first trick is to cut off the neckline and make sure that the old back, which is now the new front, is as low as the front usually is. Next, you fold it in half and cut down the center of the back, creating the opening for the cardigan. Next, we need some fabric to use for the collar and the pockets and the placard in the front. And for this, I used an old sweater, making sure I had it all nice and even. And then using a rotary cutter, I cut off the bottom of the sweater to use for the opening of the cardigan. Cuffs from the sleeves will make wonderful little pockets. And then, because I'm gonna have such an, a, a large opening for the neckline, this cowl neck is gonna be perfect. After cutting the bottom ribbing into two sections, one for each side, I clipped and surged them carefully onto the cardigan, leaving a little bit extra on the bottom to fold over and tuck and then flip inside out so that it would make a nice finished bottom. A serger is wonderful for doing this. Because we now have an extra large neckline, this cowl neck from the sweater is perfect for finishing off all of the neckline and matching it up. It really worked nicely. And then I added the pockets at an angle and top stitched with a triple stitch zigzag. Um, it's usually used for elastic, but it really worked nicely for finishing off the edges and, and doing the top stitching. And then I gave it to Mama. The front label is now on the back and the collar can be worn open or she can close it and keep it up close to her neck and even add a darling vintage pin to hold it in place on either side because, you know, she likes options too. I wonder where I got that from. <laughs> Thanks so much. Come back and see us again here at Cedar Quilts, Toodaloo. And yeah, I even rolled her hair and... Uh, Gave her a pedicure because, you know, it's nice to do little favors for your mama. Take care. God bless. Toodaloo.